Hey everyone and welcome back to part four of our Sims in Bloom series with Daisy and Yogi here. Um, last time we left things on a sort of okay note after a pretty chaotic episode to be honest um, with Daisy's items getting repossessed after she couldn't afford to pay her bills in time. As mentioned in the last episode I was gonna have Daisy go out um, on a few dates today or at least one date um, with possible love interest Daffy, Hallie here and also John um, because for the challenge we do need to marry someone that has the what is it loves outdoors trait? Yeah, the Loves Outdoors trait. So we're currently in a club called the Fantastic Gardeners and one of the requirements of joining the club is you must have the Loves Outdoors trait. So this was sort of our way of, um, I guess, creating our own virtual dating pool. So after much thought, um, obviously Gregory's married, so we're not going to go there. Juliana is one of our closest friends in the group, one of the first people we met, but I sort of just get like friend zone vibes from her. So I'm sort of going to... Um, see how we go with John, Hallie and Daffy um, and then obviously if that doesn't work out we can extend it maybe to Juliana. I don't think we'll get involved with Gregory just because he is married at this stage. However it is perfect timing that Hallie is actually turned up this morning so I think what I'm gonna get um, Daisy to do right away is to ask her on a date. I don't know if we could do it from the menu because we don't have any flirtation but if I come into here huh. I might get them to travel together somewhere. Oh, Yogi in the little picture. All right, let's grab Hallie. I think I'm going to take them to this cafe here that's sort of close to our house. Um, I was thinking about maybe going to the beach because we are in summer, but I'm not sure if it is going to be sunny in Solani. So I think we'll just stay in Brindleton Bay for now. Here we are. Um, I've decided to bring um, Daisy and Hallie sort of just across the road to this little cafe here. I think we only live yeah, just here. So I think we probably just like had a little walk through this tunnel. Oh my goodness, there are little people here <laughs> to this tiny cafe. Um, I'm not sure if this is, oh yeah, you can request a table. Is there only two tables? Let's have a look upstairs. Oh no, cool, perfect. All right, I might get them to come sit at this table because it is outside. All right, um, Daisy's just standing in the bathroom, staring at the wall instead of getting a table. So hopefully she gets a move on. She's gonna be like, hi. Can I please get a table for two? <laughs> I'm on a first date today. Perfect. Jennifer's calling us. He's wondering if we want to go over to his house and hang out. I do want to, but we are out with Hallie at the moment, so maybe we'll pop by a little bit later today. Um, do we have work today? No, 22 hours. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> um, let's go sit together. Aww. That's such a cute outfit she's wearing. They're kind of matching. Oh, look at these two. We're gonna order for the table. All right, um, I think I'll just get orange juice for them both because it is mm, breakfast time. Um, I was tempted to get a fruit salad, but then I realized I've actually been eating a fruit salad <laughs> for the whole week. So maybe we'll get something different. Okay, I'm gonna get a spinach and mushroom quiche for Hallie and I'm gonna get some Mm, fried fish for Daisy since she just loves fishing. <laughs> we'll get those. Hopefully Hallie comes and sits with us. I would love to talk to you. What are you doing? Okay. <laughs> okay, random naked man. We'll pretend he's not there. Um, maybe we'll sort of just say a few friendly things to her first just to see. I sort of get the vibe that um, Hallie's kind of headstrong. Um, and she doesn't really take any bull crap from anyone, which, you know, might be good for Daisy since she's really like quite like a lighthearted person and will always hold her tongue. She probably needs someone to like help build her confidence. Okay, I'm going to go in here and ask if she's single. Daisy has learned that Hallie is single. That's wonderful. <laughs> she's unplayed with the MC control center. So I've got it set that my Sims can do as they please. So a lot of the time they will just randomly get married or get have kids. So it's good to know that Hallie is single. I'm going to make a flirtatious, flirtatious joke because we are in a playful mood. Oh my goodness. This is our waiter. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, have your meal. Hallie, 
did actually like that little flirt, so we might throw in another one, but I just don't want to get it too ahead of myself. Let's do a flirt and maybe a pickup line and we'll just, maybe we'll leave it at there for a little bit. I want to get to know her a little bit more and find out the rest of her traits. Um, so I think we'll focus on that. We'll have some deep conversations and we'll discuss her interests. She's really picking up what we're putting down though. So both the girls uh, almost finished their meals. I feel like this was like a nice date. They didn't really get too far on it, which was all right. I'm gonna end for a meal and pay because is this a shirtless like waiter service? <laughs> All of the waiters are like naked. They just have little pants on. What the hell? <laughs> oh my goodness, that's hilarious. Okay, um, I might come over here and then sit together at the park. Um, Daisy is feeling very flirty at the moment, which is, I guess, the worst thing. Oh, excuse you. Stinky. <laughs> All right, I want to get to know all of her trades, so I'm going to ask. Oh, she's off. Okay, all right, I think I might take that as a sign to head home and have a shower and have a nap because we are absolutely knackered. Okay, we are finally home. Um, we'll come say hi to Yogi. I feel like we've been neglecting her just a little bit, so I want to make sure we're giving her enough love. Hi, Yogi. How are you, sweetie? <laughs> I know you stink, Daisy. We'll get you in the shower. Just say hi to your beautiful kitty first. Oh my goodness. I, I'm not sure what that fish did to her, but she's been a little bit gassy ever since we went to the restaurant. <laughs> I love this little love heart. It's so cute. Do we know all of um, Yogi's traits? Oh, affectionate, okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, I think the um, laser actually changes um, depending what mood you're in. So I think it was pink with hearts because she's in a flirty mood. All right, I'm just gonna get Daisy to have a shower and then have a bit of a nap and then I will be back. Okay, um, we've slept for about two hours and our sleeping is actually looking good. Why don't vampires go to barbecues? They don't like steak. Did you laugh? Um, sure. <laughs> So I'm just gonna wake Daisy up. Um, I'm pretty sure the Festival of Light is on as well as the Spice Festival. So I'm actually really tempted to go to the Festival of Light. Um, I would love to go to that. So hopefully she'll get up in a second and maybe we can send her there with a few friends. Maybe we'll take um, Daffy or John since we've spent the morning with Hallie. All right, so Festival of Light. I don't know whether I should take Daffy or John. I think we'll take Daffy. All right, we've arrived at the Festival of Light and Daisy is very, very gassy. I'm gonna get her to say hi to Daffy. Oh, look at these two. You can say, hey Daffy, how are you going? I was hanging out with Hallie this morning and I was thinking of you, so I'm really glad you came along with me to the Festival of Light. This guy is very flirty. <laughs> and he's getting chased by bats. What? Wait, what? Who are you a fan of? Oh my goodness. Okay, so I think what we're going to do is come over here and purchase a festival kimono and then we'll come over here and chat with Daffy. These two married? They're like flirting. Cute. She's dancing. <laughs> Let's go dance with her. Are we in our... <gasps> Look how cute we are in our traditional outfit. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, I really want them to come sit together and talk a little bit so I'm just gonna... Fine, I'll park them at this bench over here. Stop dancing. So we're just gonna have a chat with Daffy um, and see if she's gonna pick up what we're putting down. Ask about day. Oh my God, I hate that the Sims just get up all the time. <laughs> Compliment her outfit. Ma'am, what are you doing here? Ma'am, please leave our table. Get out of our conversation, please. <laughs> That's all right. Let's just have a nice chat with Daffy. We don't actually have as much friendship with her as we did with Hallie so I'd be interested to get to know her a little bit more before we like um, put any flirts down um, just in case she does reject them because of the low friendship level so I'm just gonna do a little bit of charisma 
Um, I'm going to ask if she has any siblings. I know she doesn't, but we'll <laughs> well, Daisy doesn't know that, so Daisy can ask. We'll complement her outfit. We have an outfit similar to this, so I would say their style is a little bit similar when Daisy's in her like more like houseware garden clothes. I think um, Daphne has a bit of a, a grungy taste, so yeah. She's a goofball. Cute. We'll discuss our interests. All right, so I'm actually going to ask if she's single as well. Hi. <laughs> Ooh. That didn't end well, did it? We've learned that she's single, but I don't know if she liked us asking that. I'm gonna just get her to take a photo with Daffy um, because we did purchase a new outfit for this event. Oh no, let's take a photo of. <laughs> let's take a photo with her. Oh my God, she's being so silly. Is it because she's a goofball? <laughs> what is that? It's so funny. Cheese. Cute. Look at them. Oh my goodness, Daisy. You have to stop farting in public. <laughs> I don't know what you ate. Was the fish really that bad? Um, let's have a deep conversation with her. She keeps running away from us. This sort of doesn't give me the best vibes, but it's just also just a Sims thing, so it could just be happening. Let's make a flirtatious joke and do a little bit of a flirt. Daisy's in a bit of a mood as well, to be honest, so <laughs> I don't really blame her. I'm going to take a photo of her in her little outfit because she's so cute. All right, let's see if this flirt goes well. Oh, she's in a playful mood. Oh, she liked that. Oh, Daffy's feeling flirty. <laughs> it's sort of hard to tell because neither one of them. I mean, I think Hallie flirted back a little bit, but Daffy's sort of I don't know. I just don't know if she's interested. Like, she keeps just kind of running away from us. Let's see if she does anything. No, she's like, she doesn't even want to talk to us. <laughs> I might go over here and join in some of the festives since we're at the festival. Let's do a selfie with Yamachan and do the mountain move. I want to see this mountain move. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's just every other dance. Wait, what? Did we get a bad sentiment with someone? unreliable and immature okay well don't talk to him then <laughs> he's a teen oh my goodness all right I'm gonna get Daisy to come make a wish with Daffy um I feel like from this date they sort of are more sorted to just be friends but I'm not gonna give up just yet unless someone else maybe John or Hallie comes to our rescue but I, my sort of plan is to flirt with them all a little bit and then just see if e any of them invite us on a date because um, I really just want them to like show what they're into yeah it's sort of too early to tell and we don't have any sentiments with her yet and we don't know her traits I feel like I've been trying to get to know Daffy this whole time and she sort of just keeps running away um, she's really cute though so I'm a little bit sad about that but I think if we're even just friends with her, I'd be happy with that. She's getting pretty hungry and pretty tired. I'm going to get her to come make a wish on this tree. And then I think I'm going to send her home to have some food. Does it tell me what I what you wished for? No? Okay. Oh, uh, maybe. Hope it comes true. Who knows? Maybe that little piece of paper is just what Daisy needed to see their wish come true. Well, I hope so. Right, I'm just gonna send her home. Let's go Daisy. Okay, Daisy is back home and I've had her sleep in until seven o'clock now. She actually has work today, so I'm gonna select to send her in. She's almost at full energy and I'm gonna get her to come have some breakfast. I'll get her to make a fruit salad. Um, I also think we probably should do a grocery order. <laughs> it's been a few days now and we've just been eating fruit salad. So I'm gonna order a delivery for groceries and I'm also just gonna open up the fridge yeah okay we've just got some fruit in there still I'm tempted to plant some of these bananas I don't know if we have much room maybe I'll have to plant them somewhere else maybe in the front yard like on this side of her meditation I'm not really sure yeah I don't know maybe I will just put them in the fridge <laughs> I don't really like bananas anyway so that's all right Yogi what are you doing I'm trying to make a salad <laughs> Oh my goodness, she's still so gassy. I don't know what she ate yesterday. Was it the fish? That's so random. Maybe she's like a vegan or something and I gave her fish. <laughs> so now she just feels 
awful. When she has a salad, um, I'll get her to work and I might get her to work hard today so we can try get a promotion. <gasps> oh no, our delivery is here. Don't, okay, I'm gonna get her to skip work um, so we can accept the delivery. <laughs> and then I'm gonna get her to go to work. Can I put this in the fridge? It's gonna go bad if I leave it on the bench. Oh my God. Okay, just go to work, it'll be fine. <laughs> Hi, Yogi. What are you doing on the fridge? <laughs> She's so cute. It's good to hear your voice, Daisy. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Amara Aran a little better as a friend. They seem like good company. Um, I think you should go for it. I don't know who that is. Are we friends with this person? Oh, this is the, is this the lady that we have a um, sentiment with? <laughs> and she thought we were like pretentious or something. Okay, good for you, dad. Let me know how you go. Daisy is almost done her work day and I think we're definitely gonna get a promotion today. Yay, we did. We are now level three at the Garden of Korea. Um, the first thing I'm gonna do is get her to come and unload this delivery bag before the food goes bad. <laughs> did she put it in the fridge? Open. Yeah, perfect. I'm curious to see what recipes she can make now. Quite a few things. Perfect, okay, cool. Um, I'm actually gonna take this strawberry and come and plant it outside. All right, so I'm just gonna get Daisy to um, tend to the plants for the, probably the remainder of the afternoon. Um, <laughs> she's probably a little bit annoyed because she's just worked all day as a gardener and now she's coming out here to do more gardening. But lucky for us, um, it's actually, hey, Hallie Oakley would like to come over and hang out, is that okay? Uh, yeah, of course, come on over. Um, what I was saying was lucky for us, it's actually one of her likes. So um, she actually gets her fun up from gardening. I'm going to um, harvest all of these. Hallie's out here having a chat to us. Let's say hi to her. Um, we'll ask her about a day. We'll tell her about ours, how we worked all day and now we're doing more work. Um, Daisy really needs the bathroom. So I'm gonna quickly send her to the toilet and then we'll finish our gardening. I think they just flirted. They did. Ah, interesting. Okay, let's go exchange numbers with her. Okay, well, you guys are hungry and it's sort of dinner, well, way past dinner time. So I'm gonna get you to come cook together um, and we'll make some dinner for us both. Um, <laughs> you know what? I think it's gonna have to be a fruit salad. <laughs> Again, I'm so sorry. I don't have enough ingredients for both of us for any of our other foods. They're just flirting in the bathroom. <gasps> oh, and we know all of her traits now. Hallie is gentle, ambitious, and loves the outdoors. And she's a writer. Friendly advice. Hallie remembers when Daisy listened to her problems and shared some thoughtful advice. Oh my goodness, that's so sweet. Oh my God, I need you guys to come cook. <laughs> They're really getting along really well. Their friendship is like halfway now. I don't feel like I it was off that much before she came over. This kitchen is tiny, so I'm not really sure what space we have for them both to cook. Here they are, cooking together. <gasps> Watch out, Hallie. <laughs> you like the smell of those apples? Oh my God, Daisy. I thought you were a better cook than this. She's almost level three. We're actually doing pretty well with our fishing and gardening skill. We do need to get up our wellness a bit, but I'm sure we'll get there. I think they just earned another sentiment. Cooking together. Sims that cook together stay together. Without food, we would not exist. It is food that created us, food that connects us, food that binds us. That's pretty sweet. I know that one's like platonic, but. <laughs> what the hell? It's still really sweet. Um, We're making a salad, Hallie. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is chaos. <laughs> and Yoki's like, I'm here to help. All right. Let's grab a serving together. Okay, maybe she'll just grab her own then. Is she gonna come sit with us? No, is she gonna leave? I'll see if she can hang out for a bit. Let's compliment her outfit because it is pretty cute and it's yellow and white. <laughs> Did you want that for us? Um, we might ask her to stargaze with us. I feel like that would be really romantic. Okay, leave your ball there, love, that's all right. Aww, look at these two stargazing. Oh, they're so cute. Made a new good friend. Self-sustaining. Oh, she's not happy still because she got attacked by bats. Attacked by bats. Oh, totally digging me. This could be the start of a beautiful relationship. You know what? I think it might be. 
they're getting along really well. I might get them to um, come in and watch a little movie together before I send Hallie home. Um, let's watch a movie. Is there a romantic one? Maybe we'll just watch like a cheesy, <laughs> a cheesy movie. I'll get them to come do that. All right, come in inside. Stop stargazing. Let's go, ladies. Hey, Hallie. You gonna come join us on the couch? I'm gonna get her to make a move. <laughs> She's feeling very confident, so we'll do a bold pickup line as well. I wonder if... Look deep. I already have the option for a first kiss. <gasps> oh, look at these two. They're so cute. Suggestive conversation. <gasps> Okay, I'll get them to snuggle. Oh, oh, they're really into each other. I don't think I should invite her to stay the night. I feel like it's a little bit too early since we only went on our first date today. So I don't think I'm gonna make it go any further tonight, but I will get them to have a first kiss before we send Hallie home. Just as like a, thanks for hanging out with me today. Thanks for coming over. I really like you type thing as you do. Daisy just said no. She's like, I look, I dig her, but <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> I'll get them to come down and have their first kiss. <gasps> oh, she liked that. Okay. I think I'm going to get her. I'm just going to get um, Daisy to send Hallie home. And then I'm going to send Daisy straight to bed because she's absolutely knackered. <laughs> she's so tired. And it's one o'clock in the morning. I don't know how we keep doing this. Okay, good morning, everyone. It is the first day of fall today. Um, I'm going to wake Daisy up and we do actually have work again today. I'm going to get her to take a quick break bath before she goes into her shift. I have no idea why you're wearing long red gloves in the bathtub, but you do you girl, I guess. Um, so I think we completed everything we need today for work, but if we do have time, I might get her to come out and just tend to the garden, um, do some weeding, and I'm going to get her to sell everything just for a little bit more cash. I'm a little bit worried that our bills are due again really soon so I just want to make sure we have enough money for those uh, when it's time. So unfortunately I didn't have enough time this morning to get her to do the weeding like I said I would. <laughs> she went straight to work after she got out of the bath but that's all right. I'm going to get her to work hard today um, and hopefully her bar ends up in this top part so we can get promoted. So Daisy is home. Unfortunately she didn't get promoted but we are sitting an excellent in our job performance at the moment. So I'm hoping next time we go into work, which is in two days time, um, we will get a promotion then. I'm gonna get her to come and harvest everything in the yard um, after she's done some weeding. And I think we also need to spray some bugs as well. Um, I'm really curious to see if I can evolve anything yet. I'm not really sure. I know that the plants sort of glimmer when you can evolve them, but I just don't think any of them are ready yet. I also really think that I should take her out fishing tonight in Oasis Springs again to see if we can get a cow plant. <laughs> oh, she keeps slipping. I don't know if you guys have noticed in the past episodes, but she just keeps slipping everywhere. <laughs> hey Daisy, it's Hallie. Do you want to hang out tonight? <gasps> I do. <laughs> but I really don't like the bluffs. So I'm gonna say no to that. Um, but instead I'm gonna get her to travel to Oasis Springs and we'll invite the entire group out. Okay, we've arrived in, at the park, which is our sort of usual hangout spot at this point. I'm gonna go ahead and start a gathering. Um, and honestly, I'm just gonna get her to come here and examine the water and then just go fishing together right away so we can try and Oh, Juniper, I said I would hang out with you. I'm so sorry. I've just been so busy. <laughs> I'm going to get her to come and do some fishing straight away um, so we have a better chance of catching a cow plant or at least um, improving our fishing skill, which is currently sitting at level five, which is our highest skill. So I'm not too worried about not maxing that out, of course. <laughs> what is she doing? Oh, she's examining the water. I was like, are you glitched? <laughs> That's not how you fish. <laughs> Okay, so it doesn't look like there are many varieties of fish in here, but that's all right. We'll fish for a little bit and then we might head up um, to where we were last time. <gasps> Ooh, she has gained the outdoorsy lifestyle. That was one of the things that 
we needed to do but wasn't like mandatory to do but we did it <laughs> thank god that's amazing um i'm also going to get her to have a chat with hallie while we're here and see if she maybe wants to come stay the night tonight all right daisy has leveled up to fishing level six but still no cow plant um it's now like 7 30 at night so i'm gonna get her to stop fishing in this spot and actually head over to the fishing spot is it up here yeah up here um just to see if we can get any cow plants from up here while she's walking over i'm just gonna sell everything that she caught i'll probably only get her to stay out until maybe like 9 or 10 because she is feeling pretty tired i also don't think we'll invite hallie over tonight just because we are pretty tired um, but we don't have work tomorrow so i might see if she would want to go on a date with us and i also want to um try and level up my wellness tomorrow as well okay it's 11 o'clock now and daisy unfortunately still hasn't caught any cow plant <laughs> so i'm gonna get her to wrap up the fishing um and head home because she's pretty tired we're finally back home after a long day i think i'm gonna get daisy just to um head straight to bed um because she's pretty freaking knackered to be honest she is pretty happy though because she unlocked the outdoorsy lifestyle which is great it's not something we needed to do but we have done it so i guess that's a plus hello oh you're hungry <laughs> i'm sorry love i'm sorry go to bed now that daisy is asleep i think i might end this part here um i think we had a pretty successful day to be honest we um, went out on a date with hallie and also daffy i think our date with hallie went a little bit better in at the start but then we obviously proved that hallie actually might be the one when she invited herself over for a movie night um yesterday and we had our first kiss with her so i think for next episode i want to um have hallie over again and just see if we can up our romance a little bit. I might see if she wants to be our girlfriend after a few dates. Um, I just wanted to say now that if Daisy does end up with Hallie or another female, I'm not gonna go through the surrogacy mod or anything to have a baby. I, um, I've just got it switched on that females can impregnate other females, which I think I'm just gonna do for my game because I know it's not like realistic or anything, but I just, I don't know. I don't think it matters. Like. If they're in love they can have a baby this is this is the sims like but anyway um i hope you guys enjoyed this episode let me know what you think of hallie in the comments and let me know whether you think we should continue things with her or at least um try and go on a date with john before we make up our decision just keep in mind though he was kind of rude to us <laughs> in the last episode so so anyway um thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next time bye